know. I remember when I was little, I, I swear, I, I thought when I was younger I was going to be a YouTube influencer. Like, that was my dream. All right, I'm taking out the heatless curls now, guys. So that's the fun part. Also, for anyone who hasn't been on the live before, it's very trust the process with these heatless curls. They're literally curls, not heatless curls. They're, li they're literally going to look hideous at first. So just give it a second. Give it a second and trust the process. See, look at that. That looks absolutely hideous, but I need to brush through them before you guys judge hold on no judgment no judgment um i need to fix them oh the front bits all right oh they're a little crazy today aren't they i haven't done hit those curls in so long but i love doing them should i i want to separate them or brush them but then they lose all their kill the kill Okay, wait, I'm just gonna, oh, should I brush them or not? Because they're gonna lose their curl if I brush them, but they look really messy at the top. Oh, where's my brush? I need to like try and save this. Cause I don't know, I'm one of those people who I care so much about my part. If my part is not straight, I'm literally gonna die. I'm just, yeah, I'll just brush the top. I just sort of fixed up the part a little bit. It's a little bit messy at the back. No, because that's actually my pet peeve when I see someone who's done heatless curls and they don't brush up the top of their hair. I'm like, Ugh! I'm like, hey, are you allowed to do your hair down at school? Yeah, you not. Do you have rules at school for makeup? Um, I'm pretty sure it says it's like part of the rules you can wear foundation and like mascara, but like they can't tell the difference between like foundation, and mascara, or foundation, and blush, powder, concealer, bronzer, concealer, lip gloss, and mascara and eyebrow stuff. Guys, I want to get my... You're not even allowed two braids. At my old school, you weren't allowed to braid hair at school. Yeah, we had this whole, like, um, what is it called? Con consent meeting. We had, I don't know why they gave our grades so many consent meetings. I feel like there was something underlying going on. Um, yeah, no. My old school is actually crazy, guys. Oh, my God. I wish I could, like, name drop the school, but I'm not going to because I'm not... I'm not about to do that. It was literally crazy. There were so many like creeps as teachers. Like there was this one lady teacher and she was so just like in your personal space, right? One time I was just like, I was walking, it was during class and I went to go get a drink from the drink tab and I saw my friend was in this classroom. So I like went up and I waved through the, cause it was a clear thing. And she full jumped out of the classroom and started like, Oh my god, she was like, get out, get out. And she was like following me, like doing this. And I was like, get away from me. I literally, she was getting way too close. And I was like, get out of my space. And she said, no. And I was like, so then we had like a consent meeting that day um, with the whole grade. And so I got one of my friends to say, what if, a te what if you tell a teacher to get out of your space and they don't? And then she looked so embarrassed because she knew that like I had asked my friend to say that. And yeah. Never talked to her since then, and then I left the school. That, guys, that school was crazy. Can I tell you a little story time? Um, so I, my, oh, I don't know how to say this without getting banned. They literally one time called me up to the office and accused me of at, outside the school. Um, when, first of all, I hadn't. Second of all, they had no evidence that I did anything because I didn't. I had just, apparently I'd walked somewhere that had no security cameras with my friend and they thought that we went somewhere else to and then um they literally called me up to the office and screamed at me and like made me cry even though I hadn't even done anything and they were like give us names of who else was there because I think there were people who well there were people that were actually doing it but I wasn't one of them um and I was like no I'm not giving you names like I don't care and they were full screaming at me it was so bad it was so traumatic honestly and I didn't tell my mom fully about it because I don't know. I should have. Because I was telling my mom about it the other day and she was like, oh my God, I would have stormed up to the school and like yelled at the teachers. And I'm like, oh, you should have. You should have. But I don't know. I was just like so scared in the whole situation. They should not have pulled me aside. It was actually two grown men yelling at me. They should not. That was not okay. They should have been, um, my, one of my parents should have been present. They should have called a meeting, first of all. Especially if I didn't even do anything. Your head, thank you so much. I think they actually turned out all right, the heatless curls. I think my makeup turned out pretty good as well. So I'm happy. 
thank you guys all for joining. Why don't we do a couple rounds of that drawing game since I know a lot of people are here for that. What's my job? Um, I haven't started yet, but I guess it's like hospitality, like food and stuff. Okay, we're going to do drawing guests. We're only going to do like it for five minutes because I have to go.